welcome we will start with some basic questions and then go in detail first question what is tj audit or tj inspection full form of tj is therapeutic goods administration tj audit involves inspecting manufacturing facilities processes and quality systems under australia's regulatory framework what are the key details about the therapeutic goods administration that is tga you can refer below table for key attributes about tga including full form when it was founded its headquarters regulatory jurisdiction that is australia purpose countries covered key regulated products international alignment audit scope and website what are the key areas reviewed during a tg audit here is the list of 10 key areas that are commonly reviewed during a tg audit it includes documentation readiness gmp compliance qms effectiveness personal training equipment and calibration validation activities environmental monitoring material management data integrity and product recall procedure how does the tga classify audit outcomes tga majorly classify their audit outcomes in following six ways compliant non compliant no further action requirement kappa that is corrective and preventive action requirement manufacturing license suspension and manufacturing license cancellation how frequently are tga audits conducted tga audits are typically conducted every 2 to 3 years for manufacturing sites with more frequent audits if non compliance or high risk activities are identified the frequency can vary based on the risk profile and history of the facility which things tga regulates in the pharmaceutical industry therapeutic goods good manufacturing practices that is gmp clinical trials product registration and labeling and advertising are regulated by tga in the pharma industry what are the specific gmp guidelines referenced during tga audits tga follows the pics gmp guidelines aligned with international standards pics stands for pharmaceutical inspection cooperation scheme this one is very important question question is what is artg in tga and why it is important the artg that is australian register of therapeutic goods is a database maintained by the therapeutic goods administration that is tga that lists all the therapeutic goods such as medicines medical devices and biologicals approved for supply in australia inclusion in the artg is important or vital as it signifies regulatory compliance enabling legal supply in the australian market what is general scope of tga audit or inspection inspections cover facilities equipment personal documentation quality management system that is qms and operational practices what are the common tga inspection types first type is pre market inspection for facilities seeking gmp certification for the first time or introducing new product lines second type routine inspections scheduled based on the risk level of products and the facilities compliance history and third type is for cause inspections triggered by complaints recalls or adverse events related to the product what is tga gmp certification validity a gmp certificate issued by the tga is typically valid for 3 years but continued compliance is required to maintain certification the renewal process involves a full review or a targeted inspection based on past audit findings what are regulatory harmonization for tga tga collaborates with international regulatory bodies like fda here fda stands for food and drug administration ema that is european medicinal agency and who here who stands for world health organization to align its standards what are tga post inspection actions after the inspection the tga provides a report detailing findings and corrective actions companies typically have a deadline example 30 to 60 days to respond with a corrective and preventive action that is kappa plan what are general expectation of auditors during tga inspections auditors expect transparency and access to all requested documents and areas during inspections a well organized cooperative team improves the outcome and 
demonstrates compliance culture what are the consequences of non compliance in a tj audit the consequences can be broadly divided into the three categories first regulatory actions the tja may suspend or cancel product registrations second fines and penalties non compliance may result in financial penalties or fees for the company and third legal liabilities the company could face legal actions including lawsuits or recalls last and very important question what are the latest updates about tj audit tj has increased focus on data integrity tj auditors are prioritizing electronic records and audit trails to ensure compliance with alcoa plus principles and secondly transition period for device reclassification for medical devices the tj has extended transition deadline to align with eu mdr updates don't forget to like comment and share subscribe to channel for more videos related to our pharmaceutical industry